Judgment sampling is the method that most students forget because it's just crap, in my opinion. This is not a good sampling method to me. This is when the researcher uses their own judgment to select the sample they think will represent the population. I guess it can be good, but if you get like a crap researcher, let's say I'm just going to pick the name Tom. I apologize if your name is Tom. And you ask him to do a judgment sample. How many people have you asked Tom? Oh, I've only asked two people. Which two people did you ask Tom? Oh, I've only asked my mum and dad. That is not a good sample. Tom clearly has bad judgment. So advantages of a judgment sample is it's easy and it's quick. But disadvantages are that it's non-random. Not everyone has an equal chance of being selected. And the quality of the sample depends on the person selecting the sample. And um, what was I going to say? Oh, I lost my word. The researcher may be biased and unreliable in the sample they select. So John, not John, Tom, only asking his mum and dad is not as good as Michael asking all his school friends and teachers. So this, there is no question in an exam for GCSE statistics where it's just asked you to carry out a judgment sample. But if they were to do that, it would look something like this, maybe. I'm not going to answer this question in this video. Have a think. If you want me to answer it in a separate video, I will do. But it's just poorly written. Judgment sampling is not a good method.